hi in this lecture i'm going to show you how to save and open file inside maya so again let's create something first so that we have something for saving so let again go to windows and go to general editors content browser and let's bring something to this view let's bring this horse so let's hold middle mouse and drag to this view and let's close this okay so this is my model and now i want to save this file so that i can continue working later so let's save this so go to file and save scene again we have two options save scene and save scene as so because i have not saved this file it says untitled here you can see and the star mark is there that means it's not saved and again the name is untitled that means we have not saved yet so let's go to file save scene again it doesn't matter because i'm going to save for the first time again if you have already saved and you want to save on top of that again you can use the save scene or if you want to save in a, with a different name then you need to choose the save scene as so because it's the first time it doesn't matter so let's click on save scene okay so now this is the save as options here the save scene options you need to browse where you want to save and let's say go to my computer go to the destination where you want to save your file and let's go to let's create a folder called project files and inside that folder i'm going to give a name for this my file so let's say horse and let's save so you can see now the title bar is uh, showing the proper you know, destination and the name of the file here at the end so you can see the whole path and then the file name so that means this file is saved when i change this a little bit you can see the star mark comes again that means again i have modified this scene but i have not saved yet so from this star mark i can say if i have saved the file or not okay now let's create a new scene so you can click on this icon or you can uh, hit on this new scene options and now it's asking because the scene is changed so it's asking you to save or don't save or cancel so i'm going to again it it depends on you if you want to save the file on top of that you might want to you know, save from here in this case i'm going to don't save okay now it gave me a new file and now i'm going to open that file again so again i can open that from here or i can just click on this second icon and now okay so this is the destination here and this is my file again i forgot to mention that we saved in the dot mv file and that is for my binary so we have two options when you save my binary and my ascii so basically my binary is the main file format for maya so it's kind of the raw file format of maya and maya ascii is kind of a oldest version and it's there for you if you want to save and open with a lower version it might help with that so but we are going to you know save in my binary because this is the actual raw file format and my binary the short form is dot mb okay so here i'm going to select and open it and again it's asking to save or don't save this empty file so let's don't save now okay we can open and then work let's say I modified the character or something and now I want to save again I can save on top of that file if I want to save on top of that file basically I want to replace the file you can press ctrl s or you can hit on this icon or you can go to file and save scene if you want to save it with a different name as an increment version or something or with a different version file then you can uh, choose this save scene as option if you hit save scene it's going to save on top of this file horse mb so this is going to replace that file so make sure if you want to keep a version then choose save scene as so it's going to ask you again for a name so you can say let's say horse v2 that stands for version 2 
and now you can see you have two version one so if i go to open and you can see i can go back to the lower version or the different version i can work on different versions so let's say i i change something let's say the year and i want to save this file on top of this horse version 2 i don't want to make a different version then i can just save scene and it's going to again up to date up to date the file here so these are the ways to save and open file so in the next lecture we are going to see how to select how to select objects and how to select different components so basically we are going to see different selection methods in the next lecture